M0FXP Hamtech, welcome to my channel. I've got my node, All Star node here, which actually has a little radio built into it, and so it's sending a signal using the All Star system ham VoIP to my analog radio there. Okay, and it sounds great. But the clever thing is, because it's run by a Raspberry Pi, we can actually download an app called DV Switch. So if you go to your Play Store, put in DV Switch, and then open it, you get this app. Now to configure it, you have to go to configuration. Now everything needs to be configured for you really by whoever sells you the node. You can do it yourself, of course you can. Um, you can build the node yourself, but you know it's gonna take a lot of learning, and a lot of work, unless you're already you know, expert with that kind of thing. So you can see that we're listening to it. So when we listen to it via DV switch, we're listening via internet, nothing to do with RF radio. So I'll just show you my configuration. At the top, it says IAX2, and there's a folder inside the Raspberry Pi SD card holding hand VoIP that is called IAX something. And within that, you have a username and password. My username is my phone, and password's been preset. The IP address is just when this turns on and boots up, it sounds out an IP address of basically the Raspberry Pi. Uh, and then scrolling up, I've got my node number that you register with All Star. Just put in All Star Ham Radio and you can register that. So once you've got a Ham Radio license, you don't actually need the radio part of this board, which is, you know, fantastic in itself. I'll just zoom in. That's, all, that's the radio that's been modified from a, from a Bofeng 888 which originally looked like that, and the inside of that is this. Very fascinating. But anyway, move that out of the way. So once you've configured everything, okay, and you've got all your settings in, you go save, and you go back, okay? Go back like so, and you go to this page. Now you have to connect to your node. The first thing is to make sure that they, call, they use the word registered. So if you click here, it says registered. If it doesn't say registered, it means you haven't logged into the system the all-star system which is using the, the, the Raspberry Pi but if it says registered you're good to go go back to dialer and you can use it for many other things it doesn't have to be all-star nodes you can actually connect to all kinds of stuff with this but we're just interested in that so right now that's my node number we're going to go connect okay so we're connected to the system now now to connect node to all-star three nine zero one seven connected says these are the changes that they are. It's already connected because that was the last thing we connected to. Show, you know, it, it, what the and you control the volume or agree, you know, uh, in the normal way. People had and then what they're thinking if I can reach my volume. PTT's down here. So and when I typed my thing, I, I think star 73 is disconnect. We'll try it. Star 73 send. I'm not sure if it's going to let me send when someone's talking. Ah, hang up seems to have worked. Then we'll go star seven, three, send, just to make sure. So, let's try that number again. So we'll go connect. Then we'll go star three, four, one, five, two. Oh, hang on a minute. Let it connect. Oh, it's connecting straight to to uh, my previous connection. So I need to work out just how to permanently disconnect for that. But the main thing is, you can see, it's working great and sounding great. And the node is made by G4XYR, and the listing will be in the description if you're interested in buying something like this. Thanks for watching my YouTube channel. Bye for now, 7-3.